I've been growing the beard with the odd cut for uh, 15 months. Um, so it's still just a baby, but it's getting there. <laughs> going Viking, with a Viking fell runner one day. <laughs> My name is Adam Briggs, I'm 33 years old, living in Cockermouth in the Lake District. Fell runner, that's pretty much it. <laughs> it is what I like to do. Um, yeah, I've been doing it about four years. You never regret a run, that's the best thing. You might regret starting it, but <laughs> you never regret finishing it. <laughs> Weather plays no part whatsoever. I, sunny days are absolutely brilliant, you get some nice photographs. Wet days you come home mud up and it's just like being kids again, playing in puddles basically, but up in the fells. Um, it just makes you feel alive again. You know, fell running in the Lake District isn't easy. It's pretty steep stuff out there. I struggle on the uphills and I fly down the downhills. It's, that's the, you know, I know I'm going to find it hard going uphill with the, the condition, but coming down, I also know that I can go crazy and, and really like blitz it. But I was born really ill. Um, I was a blue baby, so like I was born without oxygen. And it was pretty, well it was apparent before I was born that I had serious heart conditions. Um, so like since birth, it's always been something to fight against the heart conditions. And it culminated in a transplant in 1992. Um, so yeah, I run, I do all this crazy stuff with the heart transplant as well. You know, when I had my transplant, if they said, oh, you'd be running 66 miles one day, I would have definitely said, yeah, whatever, like I'll die before I get that far type of thing. I think I've had, altogether, I've had about 65, 66 surgeries, so... And some of them you're awake for, so they don't really count. <laughs> I tried to make my donor proud, um, so I don't want to sit at home and be a dull bum and, you know, have this amazing gift and do nothing with it. Um, and it's like the life he never had, so like I can't just sit at home and waste it. So the fell running for me is, is a way of doing that. I've really done something with the, the gift that I've been given. There's no reason not to get out and do something. You know, everyone within reason is capable of doing a little bit more, I think. Um, but it's definitely worth it. Um, if anyone's been through any sort of life-changing surgery or sort of health event, just getting out and doing anything is better than nothing. You know, the person that runs a mile might be stronger than the person that runs ten. Yes, there has to be a little bit of fear because that helps, but not let it control your life. So yeah, just get out and just do it. Like, you know, what's the worst that can happen? For me, it's, it's quite spiritual, um, but like being out in the fells um, with friends or on my own, yeah, it's, it's quite empowering. Um, you know, it's just you against the mountain type thing. Um, you know, you feel as though it's just you against the world when you're up there. Um, and it's, it's that solitude that sometimes is all you need as well. I'll never be the best, I'll never be the quickest. Doesn't matter, I'll probably be the most stubborn. <laughs> I am who I am, you know, I'm, that's me. <laughs> you know, I've got no airs and graces, so, you know, I don't go out there to prove a point to anyone, I just go out because I love running.